The GCC central banks have all raised interest rates by 25 basis points, mirroring the move by the US Federal Reserve. This is likely to be the final hike of the cycle, given that inflation has peaked and economies are slowing rapidly. We still think the Fed will start cutting rates next year, which will allow policy to ease across the GCC. Manufacturing activity in Israel decreased in June, according to the PMI survey. This likely marks the start of several months of economic uncertainty, as nationwide protests grip the country in response to a controversial overhaul of the judicial system. The shekel has already suffered a sharp depreciation this week and will likely continue to do so, pushing up on inflation. The IMF have downgraded their expectations for economic growth in Saudi Arabia, following the cuts to oil supply in April and June. We think their new forecast for 2023 is still too optimistic, as we expect the supply cuts to be extended into September. Overall, growth for the MENA region has been downgraded for this year and next to 2.6% and 3.1% respectively. I'm John Payne and this is MENA in a Minute from Oxford Economics.